Singapore's most decorated Olympian, Feng Tianwei, will not be competing in the upcoming SEA Games. All this paves the way for two new faces on the women's table tennis team. They will be led by the games. Uh, they will be led to the games by defending women's singles champion Lin Ye. In total, ten table tennis players will compete in seven games in Hanoi. Lauren Ong with this report. Laser focus for 70-year-old Zhou Jingyi as she prepares to make her debut at the upcoming SEA Games. The youngest paddler on the squad had some large shoes to fill. Olympic medalist Feng Tianwei's absence from the competition in Hanoi means players like her have an opportunity to compete. This new generation of paddlers, uh, very young, but they have been with us for a long, long time. They have been training with us since they were very young. So, of course, there will be a, a difference between them and the senior players of the past. But I feel that in terms of uh, grit and spirit, um, they are not any lesser than our previous paddlers. With Singapore's table tennis Olympians inching towards retirement, the Games is an opportunity to groom the next generation of paddlers. No medal targets have been set for them, though both officials and athletes say the paddlers will do their best. Being able to participate in such a major Games for the first time, uh, I feel really grateful to be given the opportunity. Yeah. So, like, uh, as a debutant for these games, I just hope to uh, do my best and just enjoy the process. So I'm not really focusing that much on the results, but maybe just playing what I train out during training and just doing my best. The team will defend two gold titles at the SEA Games and face their fiercest competition from Thailand and Vietnam. Speculation around table tennis star Feng Tianwei's retirement has been rife since she announced Tokyo would be her fourth and final Olympics. She turns 36 this year. <laughs> Fellow Olympian Yu Mengri retired in March, ending a 16-year table tennis career.